When considering the concept of a digital driver's license, the first thing that comes to mind is the convenience associated with having your ID readily available on your smartphone. But a digital driver's license, or DDL, is more than just a portable image of your license on your mobile device. A DDL brings the latest innovation in digital security to the process of proving that you are who you say you are. I wasn't really sure how people would react to the digital driver's license, um, but really every time we show it to people, they see it, they want it, they want it now. A digital driver's license begins with a secure enrollment process through the DMV. Users can opt to receive a DDL in addition to their physical driver's license as part of their application or renewal process. The license data is then carefully matched with the user's mobile device through a process that incorporates unique verification codes. One of the benefits for a digital driver's license, especially for our customers, our drivers, is that if they have a change in status, they'll know it the moment they open up their app. They'll see on their driver's license, oh, I'm suspended. Oh, I, I'm about to expire. That right there is going to be huge for our public. Once a successful pairing of device and driver data has occurred, the digital driver's license can be remotely loaded onto the user's smartphone. Visually, the DDL looks similar to your physical license, and it contains a lot of the same information required to prove your identity or affirm your driving privileges. However, it's within the underlying process for ID verifications that the technological innovation in DDL is found. It's also very beneficial for the customer who wants to do an address change, where today they'd have to walk into the department, uh, fill out a change of address card, get a temporary paper license, wait for that to come from central issuance for two weeks. Um, now with that, with the digital driver's license, we have the ability to update that credential immediately on the app on the phone. The DDL can then be accessed through a mobile application using PIN or biometric authentication, such as fingerprint, to confirm the identity of the licensee. Personal data is shared only when the user triggers the transaction by selecting the specific scenario within the app. Scenarios can include proving your age, interacting with law enforcement, or passing through an airport security checkpoint. We work so close with law enforcement, so if there's action that needs to be taken against somebody's driving privileges, having that information available right away for law enforcement, for them to know the status of that license if they are to pull over somebody, is tremendous. The biggest benefit to law enforcement for a digital driver's license would be more efficiency on a traffic stop. Uh, we'll be able to get information quicker back to the officer's computer, which will mean less time roadside for uh, a trooper that's interacting with the motoring public. The relevant information is released for verification by the other party, but your phone remains securely in your hand. I don't have to hand my phone to law enforcement. I can just scan the code and they can get the information that they need. There's not a lot of equipment going into the patrol car. So it's not a lot of additional expense that we are, don't have already invested in that car. We're not trying to put a whole nother huge expensive piece of equipment anywhere in order to deploy the technology. A major benefit of digital data is that it can be grouped and shared in different ways. When you hand over your physical license, the verifier has access to all of the personal information printed on that license. But with the DDL, you can share only the information required for that specific transaction. The merchants, they can incorporate this type of product right with what they already have existing. I think that's a huge selling point. Proof of age, um, the, the way that we're demonstrating that technology right now, really all they're seeing is my picture and that I am or I'm not over the age of 21. Um, there's no other private information given there. DDL verifications require no Wi-Fi access or mobile connectivity giving users added privacy and peace of mind, knowing that their day-to-day -day DDL usage and activity is neither tracked nor stored. Everything happens in an offline mode to ensure your DDL works no matter where you are. And if your phone is ever lost or stolen, your DDL can be remotely wiped and reissued on a replacement device. From the airline side of things, you're able to utilize that device to verify age, name, date of birth, all of the things that you're looking for at a TSA checkpoint. When you arrive at the airport, the first thing that you're going to have to do is check in at the ticket counter. And there you already know that you're going to have to have your driver's license handy for identification check. To have your mobile boarding pass as well as your ID right on your uh, electronic device or your phone, it'll certainly make travel a lot easier and a lot more secure. The flight crews 
the flight attendants, the pilots themselves, the first officers, the ground handling crew, the caterers that put the food on the airlines. Everybody that's going to be around that particular aircraft or at the airport is required to have a driver's license. And in the digital format, it's going to make our job a lot easier and it's going to make it a lot more efficient. Whether you're ready to start using your digital driver's license all the time or simply have it as a secure, convenient backup to your existing credential, the benefits of DDL remain the same. I think the public is interested and excited about uh, this technology. The feedback that I got from the public and from the coworkers has so far been very positive. If the customers want something like this, this allows us to give it to them. Um, so it helps us just serve them better. If we can do this in an easy way, it interfaces well with the technology we're already using for other things, I think it's great. So really for us, it seems like a customer service win. I think it's huge benefit to the community, huge benefit to the state. Driver services alone, the benefits are, I'm just so excited.